So the Her Voice Fund has been such an amazing opportunity to really live out my dream. My role as, as the Her Voice Fund country lead in South Africa is to support these grantees, support these young women. For too long, the, the story has been doom and gloom. This is me changing what would have been my life. My name is Sibule Lesipata. The reason why I do what I do is because I lost both my parents to AIDS when I was really young. And I know what it was like as a young adolescent girl, lost, confused, not sure about who I was and what I wanted out of life, lack of support. And so I do what I do so that other girls and young women don't ever have to feel the way that I once felt. Her in her voice means the HIV epidemic response. Girls and young women between the ages of 15 to 24 uh, are disproportionately affected by HIV. My dream and vision for the future is to be able to look back. It's, it's 2030, I see it, it's 2030. We've, we're looking back, HIV is no longer an issue. It gives me goosebumps to think about the fact that we're gonna have these incredible ambassadors and grantees, which are these NGOs on the ground who are able to look back and go, we did that. I strongly believe that if we're going to change the status quo of, of girls and young women who continuously find themselves on the outskirts of, of communities and yet they're an integral part of the community, we're going to have to stand up and lead. The best kind of leadership comes from a peer-to-peer -peer kind of approach. This is why we are using or working rather with girls and young women to influence girls and, and other young women. Really, I mean, I, I, I do want to take this opportunity and say thank you. Um, yeah, just thank you. <laughs>